Hello, my name is Lee Selting, and along with Dr. Peter Perlin, we'd like to introduce you to our course, Shakespeare in England and Italy, scheduled for summer 2021. Today, we'd like to talk to you about who are we? Where goes the class? What would I be doing? When do we leave? How much does it cost? And importantly, how do you apply and are there scholarships available? Dr. Peter Perlin is Dean of the Honors College and a former chair of the English department at the University of Wyoming. My name is Lee Selting and I'm the Associate Dean of the Honors College and a former chair of the theater and dance department here at the university. We'd like to ask you to join us for three weeks abroad from May 16th through June 16th, where we'll visit Stratford-upon-Avon, England, London, England, and Italy, and the cities of Verona, Padua, Vicenza, and Venice. Our first stop will be Stratford-upon-Avon, the boyhood home of Shakespeare. While there, we'll take in productions at the Royal Shakespeare Company on the banks of the River Avon. Our days will be filled with excursions to Anne Hathaway's cottage, Shakespeare's burial grounds, and Shakespeare's birthplace. We'll take a trip to the English countryside and visit Warwick Castle. After an exciting week in Stratford, we next journey to London. The London Eye and the River Thames are popular tourist attractions. And of course, we'll take advantage. We'll take a Thames Riverboat cruise up to Greenwich. But of course, we're there to see Shakespeare. And Shakespeare's Globe Theater is where we'll see nearly all of our productions. We'll have class in Middle Temple Hall Museum in London and in locations all across London. After an exciting week there, we head to Venice, Italy. While in Italy, we'll do day trips to Verona, where we'll have class in the Giardini Gusti. We'll tour the Il Ferrari Cathedral in Venice. And of course, there's always plenty of gelato available for everyone. On our three weeks, we'll see lots of Shakespeare. And if we're lucky, the show is presented at a place like Chillum Castle on an English estate. Our locale in London couldn't be more convenient. We stay at the Mad Hatter Hotel, and it's a short walk to the Globe Theater. Our classroom is in the middle, and all of it located on the south bank of the Thames. You'll notice we're also staying near the Millennium Bridge, which most of you may know as the Harry Potter Bridge. What do we actually do in the class? Well, classes begin in Laramie on two late spring weekends in April to get oriented to the course. Our typical schedule while in England is class in the morning and the afternoon is filled with museums, tours, and topical excursions on Shakespeare. We spend our evenings attending productions or we have free time. When we move to Italy, it's completely class and excursions and tours, plus a lot of free time to explore the Italian cities and countryside. Shakespeare in England and Italy is an honors course upper division for three credits and it satisfies an ANS global requirement. Honor students do have registration priority, but there are slots for non-honors college students. So please consider applying. 
The class really has three centers of attention, selected Shakespeare plays on the page and stage, and characteristics of Renaissance and modern playing spaces and their influences on production, as well as the intercultural relations between England and Italy during Shakespeare's time. The course, again, begins in Laramie and moves to Stratford-upon-Avon, and from there we travel to London, Verona, Padua, Vicenza, and Venice. We visit a lot of fun places. What does the program cost? We will register you for HP 4154 in spring, and the $3,700 program cost covers nearly everything, all airfare, theater tickets, books, accommodations, required excursions, train tickets, and local and public transportation passes. You'll have to pay UW tuition and fees, and $140 in study abroad fees, plus $50 for international insurance, Nearly all of our breakfasts are covered while in our bed and breakfast in Europe, but the cost of your passport and any incidentals are on you. UW study abroad scholarships are available for nearly every student, and the average student gets roughly $1,100 in scholarships. Here is how you apply. Search for this program in the Cowboys Abroad portal. Any questions about the course should come to Peter or I. If you have other questions about registration or financial questions, you can contact the Education Abroad Office. Our application deadline is October 1st, 2020, but we're going to have to be very flexible during COVID. So please, if you're interested, apply early. We hope we'll see you next summer at Shakespeare in England and Italy.